Curious about the universe's hidden gems? Unleash your cosmic curiosity with the James Webb Space Telescope, revealing everything from galaxy dances to nebula whispers. Ready for an out-of-this-world journey? Let's unlock the stars together. Number 1. The protostar IRAS-23385 through the eyes of the James Webb Space Telescope. Number 1. The protostar IRAS-23385 through the eyes of the James Webb Space Telescope. Nestled in the cosmic sea, far beyond the reach of the naked eye, lies a nursery of stars, where the birth of celestial bodies unfolds. Here, the James Webb Space Telescope, humanity's most advanced observatory in space, has turned its gaze toward a corner of the universe harboring a young star in the making, known as IRAS-23385. Through the lens of its mid-infrared instrument, Myri, this telescope has captured a remarkable image, a snapshot in time, revealing the intricate dance of creation at a distance so vast it challenges the imagination. This particular portrait, bathed in hues of orange, represents a moment frozen at a wavelength of 15 microns. But why orange, you might wonder? In the realm of science, colors and images from space aren't just picked because they're pretty. They're assigned to different wavelengths of light to help scientists see what our eyes cannot. In this case, orange helps highlight specific features at this mid-infrared wavelength, offering a window into the complex processes at play around IRAS-23385. But the story doesn't end with a single image. No, it's just the beginning. The region around IRAS-23385, along with another entity named IRAS-2A, hidden from view in this snapshot, has been under the watchful eye of an international group of astronomers. Their mission, to peer into the cradle of potential life-bearing planets to understand the chemistry of the cosmos in its infancy, before planets like our own have even formed. What have they found, you ask? Thanks to the unparalleled capabilities of Webb, the team has made a groundbreaking discovery. The ingredients necessary for the birth of habitable worlds, the building blocks of life as we know it, are already present in these early-stage protostars. Through Miri's sharp eye, which can pick out the faintest whispers of light from the deepest corners of the universe, scientists have identified organic molecules frozen in interstellar ice. These aren't just any molecules. They're complex organic compounds like acetaldehyde, ethanol, yes, the same alcohol found in drinks, methyl formate, and even acetic acid, which is a component of vinegar. Imagine the seeds of life's complexity potentially leading to habitable worlds, floating in the icy reaches of space, waiting to be woven into the fabric of new planets. This revelation not only expands our understanding of the universe, but also hints at the profound possibility that the conditions for life are more common than previously thought. As we stand on the cusp of new discoveries, questions abound. How do these molecules form and survive in such harsh environments? What does this mean for the search for life beyond Earth? The James Webb Space Telescope, with its piercing gaze, continues to unravel the mysteries of the cosmos, offering us a glimpse into the origins of stars, planets, and perhaps life itself. In every captured image and uncovered molecule, we find more pieces of the cosmic puzzle, drawing us closer to understanding our place in the vast expanse of the universe. As we delve deeper into the mysteries of space with Webb, we're reminded of the limitless potential for discovery, where every new finding is a step toward answering the age-old question, are we alone? With each revelation, the universe seems a little less vast, a little more familiar, bridging the cosmic distances with knowledge and bringing the stars a little closer to home. Number two, the enigmatic spiral of NGC 5468. Located in the constellation of Virgo, the spiral galaxy NGC 5468 presents a fascinating chapter in the exploration of our universe. This galaxy, situated about 130 million light years away from Earth, captures the attention of astronomers for a very special reason. Through the combined observations from the James Webb Space Telescope and its predecessor Hubble NGC, 5468 serves as a critical marker in our quest to comprehend the universe's expansion. 
What sets NGC 5468 apart in the cosmic landscape is its role as a host to Cepheid variable stars. These stars are not your ordinary celestial bodies. They pulsate at predictable rates, growing brighter and dimmer over cycles. This rhythmic dance allows scientists to determine their distance from us with remarkable accuracy. The discovery of these stars in NGC 5468 by the Hubble telescope marks it as the most distant galaxy where such measurements have been possible, making it an invaluable resource for astronomers. But there's more to NGC 5468 than meets the eye. The galaxy was also the site of a type IA supernova event. Supernovae of this type are incredibly bright, so much so that they can be seen from vast distances across the universe. Because of their luminosity, they serve as another tool for measuring cosmic distances. By comparing the distance measurements from the Cepheid variable stars with those from the supernova, astronomers can refine their understanding of how quickly the universe is expanding. Spanning roughly 75,000 light years, NGC 5468's spiral form is a sight to behold. The galaxy, measuring about 2.1 arc minutes across in the night sky, is a testament to the scale and wonder of the universe. The data collected from this galaxy not only enhances our understanding of celestial mechanics, but also contributes to our broader understanding of the cosmos. Why does this matter, you might wonder? By piecing together how far and fast the universe is expanding, scientists can uncover clues about its origins, its current state, and where it might be heading. This kind of knowledge is crucial for our understanding of cosmic phenomena, from the birth of stars and galaxies to the ultimate fate of the universe itself. NGC 5468, with its galaxy arms stretched out in the vastness of space, represents more than just a beautiful image. It's a key to unlocking the mysteries of the cosmos. As we continue to observe and study galaxies like NGC 5468, with the James Webb Space Telescope, we inch closer to answering fundamental questions about our existence and the universe. What more will we discover as we delve deeper into the unknown? Each new finding is a step toward unraveling the grand story of the cosmos, connecting us to the intricate tapestry of space and time. Number three, the intriguing silhouette of the Dark Tower. In the realm of astronomy, the practice of naming celestial objects often sparks curiosity and wonder, and the cosmic structure known as GN 16.43.7.01 is no different. Commonly referred to as the Dark Tower, this cometary globule captures the imagination not for its association with comets, but rather for its visual resemblance to them. It boasts a dusty, dense head that transitions into a long, shadowy tail, creating a striking figure against the backdrop of space. This image, showcasing the Dark Tower in all its mysterious glory, was captured by the James Webb Space Telescope, stationed at ESO's Paranal Observatory in Chile. Situated approximately 5,000 light-years from our home planet in the Scorpius constellation, the Dark Tower is a fascinating study in cosmic birth and transformation. Within its shadowy confines, Dense pockets of gas and dust are in a constant state of collapse, setting the stage for the formation of new stars. It's a reminder of the ceaseless cycle of cosmic rebirth that occurs across the universe. What gives the Dark Tower its distinctive appearance, you might wonder? The answer lies in the powerful influence of a group of young, luminous stars located just out of the image's frame to the upper left. The intense radiation from these stars has sculpted the globule's shape and illuminated its surroundings with a characteristic pink glow. This glow is a telltale sign of hot, excited matter, highlighting the globule against the cosmic canvas and lending it the eerie beauty for which it has been named. Classified as a dark box globule within the Milky Way, the Dark Tower exists in a category of nebula known for their role as cradles of star formation. Located in the constellation of Scorpius, this particular globule presents a unique opportunity to study the processes that lead to star birth, offering insights into the life cycle of stars and the dynamic forces that shape the universe. But what drives the intense radiation that molds the Dark Tower and ignites the birth of stars within it? 
The answer lies in the energetic processes at the heart of young stellar clusters. These clusters emit vast amounts of energy, carving out spaces in the surrounding dust and gas and triggering the collapse of material needed to form new stars. It's a process that underscores the interconnectedness of cosmic phenomena, where the birth of one star can catalyze the creation of another. The Dark Tower, with its imposing silhouette and the mysteries it holds, is a testament to the ever-evolving nature of the cosmos. It challenges us to ponder the forces at work in the distant reaches of space and the potential for life and new worlds within these dark nurseries of stars. As the James Webb Space Telescope continues to peel back the layers of the universe, revealing the secrets of objects like the Dark Tower, we are reminded of the vastness of space and our quest to understand it. What other mysteries await discovery in the shadows of space? And how will our understanding of the cosmos change as we uncover them? The journey to find out is as boundless as the universe itself. Number four, the spider galaxy. Nestled in the depths of space within the constellation of Leo Minor lies a unique and intriguing celestial phenomenon known as UGC 5829, or more vividly, the spider galaxy. This irregular galaxy, situated about 30 million light years from our home, offers a rare glimpse into the complex and dynamic nature of the cosmos. Unlike the more commonly known spiral and elliptical galaxies, irregular galaxies like UGC 5829 lack a distinct shape, making each one a unique cosmic fingerprint in the universe's vast expanse. The nickname Spider Galaxy arises from its appearance its extended, distorted arms, dotted with regions of star formation that shine brightly, resemble the legs of a spider poised in space. These arms, stretching out into the darkness, are a hive of activity where new stars are being born, illuminating their surroundings with a youthful glow. This comparison to a spider not only captures the imagination, but also highlights the galaxy's distinctive structure amidst the backdrop of countless stars and galaxies. It's worth noting, however, that there exists another galaxy with a name that could cause a mix-up, the Spiderweb Galaxy. Despite their similar nicknames, these two galaxies couldn't be more different. The Spiderweb Galaxy, extensively studied and photographed, especially by the Hubble Space Telescope, is an entity residing nearly 300 times further away from Earth than the Spider Galaxy. This vast difference in distance showcases the diversity and scale of cosmic structures that inhabit our universe. But why does the Spider Galaxy, or UGC 5829, captivate those who gaze upon it? Part of the fascination lies in its mystery. Being relatively faint and less observed, it teases the curiosity of astronomers and space enthusiasts alike. What secrets does it hold within its irregular bounds? What can its star-forming regions tell us about the life cycle of galaxies and the universe itself? As the James Webb Space Telescope turns its advanced capabilities toward objects like the Spider Galaxy, we stand on the brink of uncovering new knowledge. This remarkable observatory, designed to peer into the depths of the universe with unprecedented clarity, may soon reveal more about UGC 5829's composition, history, and the process is driving its star formation. Imagine, if you will, the stories hidden within the spider galaxy's light. Each glowing tip on its sprawling galactic arms could be a nursery of newborn stars, each with its potential planets and perhaps the building blocks of life itself. How did this galaxy come to take on such a striking form? What can it teach us about the diversity and evolution of galaxies across the cosmos? The exploration of galaxies like UGC 5829 not only broadens our understanding of the universe, but also deepens our appreciation for the beauty and complexity of the celestial tapestry in which we find ourselves. With each discovery, with each galaxy unveiled, we add another piece to the puzzle of our cosmic origins, drawing ever closer to answering the profound questions of our existence in this vast and intriguing universe. What other marvels await discovery in the uncharted depths of space? Only time and the continued pursuit of knowledge will tell. Number five, a galaxy cloaked in stardust. In this captivating image, 
we are treated to a celestial vista overflowing with stars, all set against a canvas painted with the delicate brushstrokes of cosmic dust, gas, and the faint glow of distant universes. At first glance, you might think you're simply staring into a dense cluster of stars. Yet what we're actually observing is an entire galaxy known as ESO 245. 5. This galaxy is not just any cosmic entity, it's our galactic neighbor, residing a mere 15 million light years away in the constellation Phoenix. Identifying ESO 245, 5 as a galaxy amidst this star-filled portrait may initially challenge the observer. Unlike the mesmerizing spiral galaxies frequently showcased in images from the Hubble telescope, ESO 245, 5 doesn't immediately reveal its galactic nature. This galaxy's subtle charm lies in its classification as an IBSM galaxy, according to the De Vaucouleur system of galaxy classification. This label might seem like a cryptic mix of letters and symbols, but it tells us a fascinating story about the nature of ESO 245, 5. The I in its classification signifies that ESO 245, 5 is an irregular galaxy, meaning it lacks the symmetrical structure often seen in spiral and elliptical galaxies. This irregularity is evident in the image as the galaxy doesn't display a clear organized pattern. Instead, it's a sprawling expanse of stellar beauty. The B suggests that the galaxy boasts a barred structure at its core, a dense, elongated formation of stars that cuts across its center, providing a foundation for the galaxy's form. When we see the S in the classification, it hints at the presence of a spiral structure, though it's so subtle that it might escape immediate notice. This spiral is not the prominent winding arms we're used to, but rather a gentle whisper of galactic rotation. And finally, the M at the end of the classification draws a parallel between ESO 245, 5 and the Magellanic Clouds, indicating that this galaxy shares characteristics with these well-known dwarf galaxies orbiting our Milky Way. Understanding the intricate classification of ESO 245, 5 offers us more than just a lesson in galactic anatomy. It invites us to appreciate the diversity and complexity of the universe's building blocks. Each galaxy, from the perfectly spiraled to the chaotically irregular, tells a unique story of cosmic evolution and beauty. What secrets does ESO 245, 5 hold within its star-studded bounds? How did its barred structure and hints of spiral arms come to be? The James Webb Space Telescope, with its unprecedented ability to peer into the depths of the cosmos, may soon provide answers to these questions, unraveling the mysteries of our neighboring galaxy and enhancing our understanding of the universe's grand design. As we delve deeper into the cosmos with tools like the James Webb Space Telescope, galaxies like ESO 245, five remind us of the endless variety and wonder that space holds. Each observation, each galaxy we come to know, adds another piece to the puzzle of our universe, enriching our knowledge and expanding our sense of wonder. What more will we discover as we continue to explore the vastness of space? Only time and relentless curiosity will tell. Number six, the Vela Supernova Remnant. Ever wondered what becomes of a colossal star after it has concluded its life cycle? The universe holds onto these endings, not as mere memories, but as magnificent cosmic phenomena. One such spectacle is showcased in the Vela Supernova Remnant, a testament to the universe's dramatic cycles of birth, life, and eventual demise of stars. This image gives us a glimpse into the complex beauty that follows the explosive end of a massive star. Situated in the constellation Vela, this stellar graveyard is the result of a supernova, a stellar explosion that marked the end of a massive star's life about 11,000 years ago. This cataclysmic event was so intense that, for a moment in time, the dying star would have outshone the daytime sky on Earth, becoming a beacon of its own destruction. The remnants we see today are not just ruins, but a nursery. The Vela Supernova remnant is a type of nebula, an enormous cloud of dust, gas, and plasma. It's in regions like this that the universe recycles its materials, using the remnants of the supernova as the building blocks for new stars. 
This cycle of stellar death and rebirth is fundamental to the cosmos, contributing to the complexity and diversity of the universe. A supernova remnant like Vela is classified within our Milky Way galaxy as a nebula, specifically a supernova remnant. This classification tells us that what we're witnessing is the aftermath of a supernova explosion, where the outer layers of a star were ejected into space at tremendous speeds. Over thousands of years, these materials spread out, forming the intricate structures we observe. Filaments, loops, and clouds of gas that glow with the energy imparted by the supernova. But what triggers such a monumental explosion? When a massive star exhausts its nuclear fuel, it can no longer support its own gravity. The core collapses and the outer layers are expelled, creating a shockwave that ripples through space. The energy and matter released in this process enrich the surrounding medium, seeding it with heavy elements necessary for the formation of planets and possibly the building blocks of life. The Vela supernova remnant, as captured by the James Webb Space Telescope, offers an unprecedented view into the complex aftermath of a supernova. Webb's sensitive instruments allow us to study the remnant in detail providing insights into the physical conditions and chemical compositions of the ejected material. This knowledge helps astronomers understand not only the life cycles of stars, but also the processes that contribute to the evolution of galaxies. In observing the Vela supernova remnant, we are witnessing the echoes of a cosmic finale, a reminder of the dynamic and ever-changing nature of the universe. It's a stark illustration of how the end of one celestial chapter paves the way for new beginnings. What secrets will further study of the Vela remnant reveal? How do the life and death of stars influence the architecture of the cosmos? With each answer, we peel back another layer of the universe's mysteries, drawing ever closer to understanding the grand tapestry of existence. Image number seven, the celestial cradle, IC 2944's stellar nursery the heart of a celestial cradle, IC 2944, a stunning stellar nursery that has recently been unveiled in breathtaking detail to mark the 15th anniversary of the operation of the Very Large Telescope. This image brings to light a vibrant scene of creation and transformation within the Milky Way. Located 6,500 light years away in the constellation of Centaurus, IC 2944, also known as the Running Chicken Nebula, is not just a single spectacle but a complex tapestry that combines the forces of nature to birth stars. This region is particularly noted for featuring a striking set of dark formations known as Thackeray's globules, named after the astronomer who first studied them in detail. These are dense clouds of cosmic dust and gas, standing in stark contrast against the backdrop of a softly glowing pink nebula painted by the light of newborn stars. These globules present a fascinating paradox of creation and destruction, shaped by the very forces that make them visible. The intense ultraviolet radiation from the cluster's youthful hot stars bombards the globules, causing them to both erode away and break apart, much like butter melting and fragmenting in the heat of a skillet. This relentless radiation sculpts the globules into their unique forms highlighting the ongoing battle between the forces of coalescence and dispersion that govern the cosmos. Yet despite their resilience, Thackeray's globules face an uncertain future. Scientists believe that these dense pockets of matter are in a race against time, struggling to collapse under their own gravity to birth new stars before the harsh radiation from their stellar neighbors tears them apart. This delicate balance between creation and destruction is emblematic of the processes that have shaped the universe for billions of years. What makes the view of IC 2944 particularly compelling is its illustration of the life cycle of stars, from the serene beauty of star formation to the dynamic interactions that dictate the fate of cosmic matter. Within this nebula, we see the stages of stellar evolution unfold, offering clues to the origins of stars and the complex interplay between light and matter. The James Webb Space Telescope, with its unparalleled ability to peer into the depths of space, could provide even deeper insights into regions like IC 2944. By observing the infrared universe, 
Webb is poised to uncover the hidden processes of star formation, revealing the intricate dance of dust and gas that escapes the naked eye. As we gaze upon the stellar nursery of IC 2944, we are reminded of the vast and dynamic universe that surrounds us, a universe filled with cycles of birth and death, creation and destruction. What lessons can we learn from these celestial phenomena about the nature of the cosmos and our place within it? How do the forces that sculpt Thackeray's globules mirror the broader dynamics of galaxy formation and evolution? Each observation, each image captured by the eyes of our telescopes, brings us closer to understanding the grand narrative of the universe, a story in which we are all, in some way, participants. Number 8. Flame Nebula's Hidden Stars In a groundbreaking reveal by the world's most comprehensive survey telescope, we are granted an unprecedented glimpse into the heart of a cosmic masterpiece known as the Flame Nebula, or NGC 2024, located in the constellation of Orion the legendary hunter of the skies. Traditionally, the core of this nebula has remained a mystery, shrouded behind dense veils of cosmic dust that obscure its vibrant heart from the eyes observing through visible light. However, with this latest image captured in the infrared spectrum, the once hidden cluster of youthful stars at the center of the flame nebula shines through, offering a view into the cradle of stellar birth. Positioned at a distance of about 1,500 light-years from Earth, the Flame Nebula is a bustling region of star formation. This image not only showcases the nebula itself, but also frames the enchanting glow of the Reflection Nebula, NGC 2023, just below the center, and provides a spectral glimpse of the Horsehead Nebula, Barnard 33, toward the lower right. Adding to the celestial spectacle, the luminous bluish star towards the right of the image is none other than one of Orion's belt's renowned stars, anchoring the image in the familiar night sky. The creation of this image was a meticulous process, utilizing Vista's capabilities to observe through J, H, and K's filters within the near-infrared part of the spectrum. This technique peels away the nebula's dusty curtains, revealing the ongoing drama of star formation within. Covering an area of about 40x50 arc minutes, nearly half of Vista's full observational field, the image compiles 14 minutes of total exposure time to bring forth the detailed beauty of this stellar nursery. The Flame Nebula's heart, now visible in this infrared view, is a bustling hub of new stars coming into existence. Infrared astronomy allows us to bypass the dust that typically hides such star-forming regions from view offering a clearer understanding of the processes that govern the birth of stars. This insight is invaluable for astronomers who study the life cycle of stars and the dynamics of nebulae. The wide field view provided by this image also places the flame nebula in the broader context of its cosmic neighborhood, offering a unique perspective on how stellar nurseries like NGC 2024 interact with their surroundings. For instance, the interplay between the young star's intense radiation and the surrounding dust and gas not only shapes the nebula's appearance, but also triggers the collapse of more clouds into new stars. The James Webb Space Telescope, with its unparalleled infrared sensitivity, could delve even deeper into the mysteries of the Flame Nebula, uncovering the finer details of its star formation processes and perhaps revealing even more young stars and protostellar objects currently concealed. Observing the Flame Nebula in infrared light opens a window to the hidden workings of the cosmos, reminding us of the ongoing cycle of stellar birth and death that drives the evolution of the universe. What secrets lie within the depths of the Flame Nebula's glowing heart? How do the young stars within shape their cosmic environment? Each new image and observation brings us one step closer to answering these profound questions, expanding our knowledge and awe of the vast universe we call home. Image number nine, the cosmic dance of 2ZW96. A pair of galaxies entwined in a cosmic dance makes a captivating scene captured by the James Webb Space Telescope. This duo, known to the astronomical community as 2ZW96, resides approximately 500 million light years from our planet, nestled within the constellation of Delphinus. This image not only highlights the main performers, 
but also features a backdrop filled with a diverse array of galaxies, each with its own story. As these galaxies draw closer in their gravitational tango, their forms blend into a spectacle of chaos and beauty. The vibrant centers of both galaxies are linked by streams of star-forming regions, glowing fiercely in the chaos. The lower galaxy's spiral arms are visibly distorted, pulled into dramatic arcs by the immense gravitational forces at play during this merger. It's precisely these regions of intense star birth that make 2ZW96 a standout subject in the infrared spectrum, glowing brightly and offering a rich field of study for astronomers. This captivating image is part of a broader investigation by Webb into the evolution of galaxies, focusing especially on nearby luminous infrared galaxies like 2ZW96. Such galaxies are veritable cosmic lighthouses, their brightness at infrared wavelengths surpassing 100 billion times that of our Sun. This investigation embarked shortly after Webb's commissioning, aiming to test its capabilities by studying intricate galactic ecosystems, including the merging marvel that is 2ZW96. This galaxy pair, previously studied by ground-based observatories and the Hubble Space Telescope, now presents an opportunity for astronomers to compare and deepen their understanding of galactic complexities through Webb's advanced observations. The James Webb Space Telescope, with its pioneering instruments, NERCAM for near-infrared observations and MIRI for mid-infrared analysis, brings a new level of clarity to our view of cosmic phenomena. For those curious about the distinctions between Hubble's and Webb's glimpses of 2ZW96, the comparison promises to reveal the unparalleled detail and depth Webb can unveil in the universe's most intricate spectacles. As we gaze upon 2ZW96, we witness not just a merging of galaxies, but a fusion of past, present, and future. Within this chaotic interplay lies the birth of new stars, the reshaping of cosmic structures, and the continual evolution of the universe itself. What secrets do the brightly glowing regions of star formation within 2ZW96 hold? How do such galactic mergers influence the destiny of the cosmos? Each observation by the James Webb Space Telescope peels back another layer of the universe's mysteries, inviting us to ponder our place in the grand cosmic ballet. Got a favorite snapshot from the universe we shared today? Was it the swirling galaxies or the glowing nebulae that caught your eye? Drop your starry pic in the comments and tell us why it's your cosmic champion. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell to stay on board our spaceship of discovery. And if you're itching for more galactic goodness, click the video on screen right now. Until next time, space cadets, keep gazing up.